What's up, people? Welcome back. I hope you had a terrific Father's Day. There was a cool article on Father's Day, but I will hold off because I need to talk about something different. Now, last night on the Sunday Night News and Nonsense Report with Spatry's Cup of Linux, we talked about something called Ubuntu Snaps, the new app packaging system, of course, from Canonical, who makes the terrific Ubuntu Linux desktop. Now, last night I did the Center Report on Manjaro on my test laptop because Spatry asked me to and it works pretty good. After we finished, Spatry wasn't feeling good. He caught a flu or a bug, so he asked me to do the editing and then, of course, upload it to YouTube. I tried to edit it in Caden Live. The title clip, I was trying to create a title clip for the podcast. It wasn't quite working right. There was some kind of a bug. Finally got it to work, but I figured, eh, no problem. Let me go into Ubuntu Mate, fire up Caden Live, and it doesn't work. It won't start. It looks like it's going to start, but it keeps closing. And this all happened after installing the updates on my system. So I went back and someone asked me to take a look at an, at an article, a very good timely article as it seems, about Ubuntu Snaps. Now, I'll have a link for this below in the show notes. I will not read all of this, but briefly, a brief history of Linux's packaging mess. Unlike Mac or Windows, Linux applications share the, share the same libraries across the system, and the main job of a package manager is to find dependencies. Linux distributions are mainly divided into two packaging formats, not all of them, but divided into two packaging formats, RPM and DEB. This causes three major problems for app developers and Linux users. Developers can take advantage of the latest libraries and offer more features to their users if, users if the distribution is still using older libraries. Number two, developers have to write and maintain apps for different distributions and mixing libraries leads to broken systems. In a nutshell, the Linux desktop is a mess. Is it? As a whole, or as it, as it says here in a nutshell, I would have to agree. It pains me to say that, but I am tired of solving puzzles. I don't know about you guys, but let me continue. Even Linus Torvalds is not a fan of this approach. And you guys know who Linus is if you are using Linux for any length of time. So with Snaps, the answer Linux is looking for. Well, I won't read all of this, but it says here, the future according to Snaps. With Snaps, the Linux desktop will become one huge platform similar to Mac OS and Windows. App developers will have to write their app once, and it will run on every Linux distribution. Let me read that again. App developers, who are terrific by the way, I know, I, I know they do their best. App developers will have to write their app once, and will run on every Linux distribution. Sounds pretty good to me, at least in theory, and that's not all it says. Snaps also brings much needed security to the Linux desktop as snaps are sandboxed and contained and don't have system wide access. Another advantage of snaps is easier and quicker distribution of apps since developers don't have to worry about system libraries. I won't read the red. The, the, the rest of this, but I will have a link for this below in the show notes. So, someone asked me to take a look at this. In theory, I think it's terrific. Uh, I'll have a link below from last night's podcast, the uh, the Center Report with uh, Spatry, uh, from Spatry's, of course, Spatry's Cup of Linux. So, in my opinion, I do believe the Linux desktop is a mess as much as I enjoy using it more than I do Windows 10 because Windows 10 also ticks me off. But in Linux, I have to be honest, I'm tired of solving puzzles. It seems like I install the core desktop, the default Linux desktop. It works great. Start to install my favorite apps, do the updates, and then the, uh, the bleep hits the fan as it were as the saying goes so i'm tired of it i'm sure i'm not the only one i still will continue to use linux because it is a great operating system when it works but is it a mess is the linux desktop a mess at this point it is until something gets standardized across every linux distribution 
In theory, it sounds terrific. I hope it's true because I enjoy using Linux desktops at least most of the time. All right, well, that's all I have for this one. Let me know. Post your comments, likes, and dislikes below. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll have a bunch of those, but that's okay because I'm here to learn, and I'm sure I'm not the only one. Thank you for watching and listening. As always, enjoy your technology, and please don't text and drive. And I think my Kazam screen recorder still works, so I will end it and upload it. Take care, guys. I'll catch you later.